1. Learn to repair things yourself. In today's consumer-driven world, the art of repairing things oneself has become somewhat of a lost skill. Yet, it's a frugal habit that can save you money and reduce waste. Learning to repair items around your home is not only practical, but also environmentally responsible. When you repair things yourself, you gain a sense of empowerment and self-sufficiency. It could be as simple as sewing up a torn shirt, fixing a leaky faucet, or patching up a hole in the wall. With resources like online tutorials and DIY communities, acquiring these skills has never been easier. Moreover, repairing items can significantly reduce your expenses. Rather than rushing to replace a malfunctioning appliance or piece of furniture, you can often extend its lifespan by identifying and fixing the issue. This approach not only keeps your wallet happy, but also reduces the demand for new products, which has a positive impact on the planet. By embracing the frugal habit of learning to repair things yourself, you not only save money but also contribute to a more sustainable and self-sufficient lifestyle. 2. Grow your own food. In an age of convenience, reconnecting with the practice of growing your own food is a valuable and rewarding frugal habit. It not only reduces your grocery bills but also allows you to enjoy fresh, organic produce right from your garden. Starting a garden, whether it's a small backyard plot or a collection of potted plants on your balcony, offers numerous benefits. You'll have access to a variety of fruits, vegetables, and herbs, which can significantly reduce your grocery expenses. Plus, homegrown produce often tastes better and is healthier since you control the use of pesticides and chemicals. Growing your own food also fosters a deeper connection to the earth and an appreciation for the effort it takes to produce what we eat. It's a gratifying hobby that can reduce your ecological footprint by cutting down on the energy and resources used in commercial agriculture and transportation. Additionally, gardening can be a therapeutic and stress-relieving activity, providing mental and emotional benefits beyond the financial savings. Overall, embracing this frugal habit not only puts fresh, healthy food on your table but also enriches your life in numerous ways. Did you find the video helpful so far? Please consider liking the video and continue this video by typing I am frugal in the comments below. 3. Look for free stuff and learn to haggle. In a world driven by consumerism, it's easy to overlook the value of free items and the art of haggling. These frugal practices can help you save money and acquire what you need without breaking the bank. Looking for free stuff doesn't mean scavenging through dumpsters. It involves keeping an eye out for opportunities to acquire items without spending money. This could include participating in community events where free items are exchanged or checking online platforms for giveaways and freebies. Many people give away items they no longer need, and you can benefit from their generosity. Haggling, on the other hand, is a skill that can be honed to secure better deals when making purchases. Negotiating the price of goods or services can lead to significant savings. Learning to haggle effectively involves researching prices, being polite but firm, and knowing when and where it's appropriate to negotiate. Both practices, seeking out free items and haggling, require a willingness to step outside your comfort zone and ask for what you want. They can lead to substantial financial savings and a more frugal, resourceful lifestyle. 4. Use coupons responsibly. Coupons have been a staple of frugal living for generations, and they remain a valuable tool for saving money when used responsibly. While the era of extreme couponing has garnered attention, a more balanced approach to coupon use is both practical and effective. Using coupons responsibly means applying them to items you genuinely need or regularly use. It's not about chasing discounts on products you wouldn't buy otherwise, as this can lead to unnecessary spending. Instead, focus on finding coupons for groceries, household essentials, or items on your shopping list. Digital coupons and apps have made couponing more accessible than ever. You can easily search for discounts on your phone and apply them at checkout, making it a seamless part of your shopping routine. By incorporating this frugal habit into your life, you can see significant savings on your monthly expenses without sacrificing the quality of your purchases. Coupons are a valuable tool for budget-conscious individuals and families. 5. Waste less and reuse items. Wasting less and reusing items is a frugal habit that not only saves you money but also reduces your environmental impact. It's about making the most of what you have and being mindful of how resources are used. One aspect of this habit is minimizing food waste. Plan your meals, use leftovers creatively, and pay attention to expiration dates to avoid throwing away edible food. 
Composting is another way to reduce waste and create nutrient-rich soil for your garden. In addition to food, consider how you can reuse and repurpose items. Instead of buying new, see if you can mend or upgrade clothing, furniture, or household items. Old jars can become storage containers, and worn-out clothing can be transformed into rags or quilts. By adopting a mindset of waste reduction and reuse, you'll not only save money by buying less, but also contribute to a more sustainable lifestyle. This frugal habit encourages creativity and resourcefulness in making the most of what you have. Congratulations, you've completed half of the frugal habits from grandma. The next half is packed with more valuable and exciting content. So let's dive into the rest of the video together, and please hit the like button if you found the video helpful. 6. Buy used items instead of paying retail prices. Opting for used items over brand new ones is a smart frugal habit that can lead to substantial savings. Many perfectly functional items are available secondhand at a fraction of their original cost. Thrift stores, consignment shops, and online marketplaces are treasure troves of pre-owned goods. You can find clothing, furniture, electronics, and more at significantly lower prices than their brand new counterparts. This practice not only saves you money but also reduces the demand for new production, which has environmental benefits. When buying used items, it's essential to inspect them carefully to ensure they meet your needs and quality standards. While some items, like clothing and books, are typically safe to buy used, exercise caution with products that require safety considerations, such as car seats or electronics. By embracing this frugal habit, you can enjoy quality items without the hefty price tag, all while reducing your environmental footprint. 7. Walk or bike instead of using a car. In a world of increasing fuel costs and environmental concerns, choosing to walk or bike instead of relying solely on a car is a frugal and eco-friendly habit that can benefit both your wallet and the planet. Walking and biking are not only cost-effective but also great forms of exercise. They save you money on gas, parking, and vehicle maintenance, while also reducing your carbon footprint. Short trips to work, the grocery store, or other nearby destinations can often be completed by foot or bike, eliminating the need for a car. To make this habit more convenient, consider investing in a bicycle and planning your routes accordingly. Many cities are becoming more bike-friendly with dedicated lanes and bike-sharing programs. By incorporating walking and biking into your daily routine, you'll save money, improve your health, and contribute to a cleaner environment. This frugal habit is a win-win for your wallet and the planet. 8. Make more, buy less. In a consumer-driven society, the idea of making more and buying less might seem counterintuitive. However, it's a frugal habit that encourages self-sufficiency and resourcefulness. Making more refers to crafting or creating items yourself rather than purchasing them. This can include homemade gifts, DIY home decor, or even basic clothing alterations. By honing your crafting skills, you can customize items to your liking and save money in the process. Buying less is about adopting a mindful approach to consumption. Before making a purchase, ask yourself if you genuinely need the item or if it's a fleeting desire. Avoid impulse buying and focus on acquiring possessions that add value to your life. Embracing this frugal habit not only reduces your expenses, but also encourages creativity and self-reliance. It shifts the focus from acquiring material possessions to appreciating the process of making and cherishing what you already have. 9. Use cash only. In a world dominated by credit and debit cards, reverting to cash-only transactions might seem old-fashioned but it's a powerful frugal habit that can help you manage your finances more effectively. Cash envelope budgeting is a simple and visual approach to money management. You allocate a specific amount of cash to various categories, such as groceries, dining out, or entertainment, and place that cash in separate envelopes. Once the envelope is empty, you're done spending in that category for the month. This method encourages discipline and prevents overspending because you can physically see the money depleting in each envelope. It also forces you to prioritize your spending and make conscious choices about where your money goes. Cash-only transactions also eliminate the risk of accruing credit card debt or paying high interest rates on outstanding balances. It's a frugal habit that promotes responsible spending and financial peace of mind. 10. Learn to go without. In today's consumer-driven culture, the idea of going without may seem unusual but it's a powerful frugal habit that can lead to significant financial savings and a more intentional lifestyle. Learning to go without means distinguishing between your needs and wants. 
While it's essential to meet your basic needs for shelter, food, and clothing, many of our purchases fall into the category of wants rather than necessities. This habit encourages you to question whether a particular expense is truly essential or if you can do without it. Going without doesn't mean depriving yourself of enjoyment or comfort. It's about making intentional choices. For example, you might choose to forego eating out multiple times a week and instead cook at home. Or, you could opt for public transportation or carpooling instead of owning a car if it's feasible in your area. This frugal habit not only helps you save money but also fosters a mindful approach to consumption. It encourages you to prioritize your financial goals and make conscious decisions about how you allocate your resources. By learning to go without non-essential expenses, you can achieve greater financial stability and freedom. There you have it, a deep dive into 10 timeless frugal habits inspired by the wisdom of our grandparents. If you found this exploration of frugal living valuable, don't forget to hit that like button. Share it with friends and family who might benefit from these tips, and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content on personal finance, sustainable living, and practical life skills.